Hey Dan, you want to tell everyone what we've done today? You mean other than sitting here and getting out of bed late and drinking beer? Yeah, the second thing we did today. Oh, after that. We've been out here doing the day. We've had Peter Haynes from In The Limelight uh, working with us on a new promo piece. Tomorrow we're getting ready to shoot uh, the second part of our DVD that we're getting ready to bring out. Yeah, well this uh, promo is going to feature on our new website and that's going to come up pretty shortly, so everybody keep an eye out for that. Funny things that happened throughout the day, especially when we got down the, down the <laughs> back there where you'll see a, a bunch of horses. It, it looked like a little bit like organised chaos and I think one of the highlights for me was Dan Steers giving me a hard time of, about nearly getting bucked off my own filly, but old mate here, meant to have a broke horse, meant to be in foal, so she's not meant to have a whole lot of gas about her. All she would do this mare is rear, buck and fart and carry on and, and he gets down the back there and he looked like a big girl, he got all white in the face and wanted to put a bridle on. I don't know where this has come from because to be honest, you're the one having all the trouble. You're the one that's too afraid to kick your horse up there. You're right. the one that the horse started spinning into a buck. Mine just did a couple hey, hey, little I, bunny hops, listen, right? Pal, I was, I was, and, and I was the one cantering down the flat. Yeah, I don't even I was, know where I this was, come from. Oh, come on, pal. You, 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 your horse is rearing up, and, and I, I think that I... I think we got some good shots. I think we got some good shots of that, too, which, which, which should look I, good. I'll tell you what did really suck today was, was getting the arse end over that jump. Oh, yeah, that was pretty cool. Yeah, hopefully on the bloopers we'll see uh, Dan James nearly break his wrist. Um, break my wrist, cool. It was, it was my thumb. I mean, see how much this guy cares? He doesn't even know what part I hurt. Well, he wants to claim that he nearly broke his thumb. He sucked about it for about an hour. <laughs> oh, come on. I had to have lunch for him, but anyway. Yeah, whatever. Where are we off to next? Mate, I think we're both headed to Queensland. Two different vehicles going two different ways. Um, I know that I've got five weeks of clinics coming up. Uh, in Queensland, I know that you've got some competition and some sail, don't you? Yeah, I'm going up to Paradise Lagoons for the first time. I'm looking forward to that. And then uh, down to Adelaide uh, directly to take some horses back and do some clinics. So, yeah, it's pretty exciting times. And then getting ready to, what, you're going back to the States? and Yeah, back to Lexington, Kentucky. We'll be over there. And we've also uh, got some fire, uh, some irons in the fire, I guess, as you say, uh, in China. So um, it's going to be a pretty full-on couple of months between now and Equitana. All right, mate, uh, some exciting times are coming up and I can't wait. Yeah, cheers, mate. See you down the road.